Welcome to a guide to a new mod on Farming Simulator 19 with me, Mr. Sealy P. This is the Laying Hen House. Only one mod to review, uh, well, today. This is yesterday's mod. I'm away on holiday, so I unfortunately missed the Ursus tractor and the slurry tank uh, from the day before. But this is the one that came out yesterday, so I'm reviewing it first in this morning. This is by Merkter Gernbauer. Um, it is um, a chicken coop for all intents and purposes, but on a much larger scale. This will hold 400 chickens, uh, or hens. Uh, we did have one a little bit like this a while ago, uh, which had the building. We did have the um, like mini silo with the auger. And the unload had a very, very small trigger and was incredibly difficult to find. This is vastly different. Uh, plus the other one, I think the chickens kind of wandered around over the place. This has got a kind of like a chicken run on the side of it. Anyway, we'll have a look install first and we'll have a quick look around the mod. So, under animal pens, right at the very end, the laying hen house. 140,000 to buy. Like I said, it's 11 slots, um, which isn't too bad. 140,000 is quite pricey. If we go and have a look at the regular chicken coops, that one will hold 400 and it's only 40,000. That said, the base model one is fairly basic. But if you just want to have chickens for having chickens, that will hold 400. If you want to go a little bit more, you know, a bit more fancy then this may be the one for you. You feed them um, wheat or barley as usual. They don't require any water on this one. Uh, the premise being that you put the feed into here, it goes up the auger into the silo, then it automatically feeds through into the building here. So what we'll do is have a quick look. We've got plenty of doors open, um, valuable livestock, entry forbidden for unauthorized persons, I think we're authorized so we've got side door we've got our main door here the main door here brings us through into where our egg boxes will spawn now the egg boxes will spawn inside this hazard marked area what i have done is i put one of the the egg pallet mods in here just to check to make sure it will work with the egg pallets and it works with the egg, egg pallet mod no problem at all i was hoping again fingers crossed for moving belts and that kind of thing that when you fed them and it started going through its operation, you might get some movement. Potentially on PC, I don't know if that's something that works on yours or not. Um, but plenty of detail going on, which I quite like. Um, we've got lights over here. Now, if you come straight on, there we go, it should work. Lights up very, very nicely. And um, we've got this kind of, um, it's hard to explain. As we go around the outside of the building, this kind of level here, this layer, of I don't know if it's supposed to be dirt I think so and you got it kind of washes right the way around the side of the building up to a certain level and it does on the inside as well the texture is very nice very neat the wood looks like wood you know um, so we've got doors that we can open here again forbidden and here we come into the main part of the building now they've all got leg <laughs> laying box egg laying boxes uh, the premise as well being with these that when they lay the eggs the eggs roll out onto a belt the belts go along it packages and that kind of thing but they do have access they are fairly free range and that they can come down these ramps they go out underneath the bottom there out to the other side I don't know why I put my light on uh, so they can come right the way underneath through here out through these bits like so and these I didn't notice at any point these closing again i didn't know whether or not at night they would open and close i did go through the night so i could get some egg boxes and didn't notice but it's a nice mod this lots of detail you can see why it's more expensive it's a much bigger building than the standard in game one now what we have also got if we just have a quick look up here not there up here this section of the roof if we come round to this machine or this bit here and press circle You kind of hear that chain drive it opens the roof up so it aerates the building it gets a bit more air in for them there you go 
the trouble is getting pressing it and getting back to have a look because you can't actually see it from this side. Quick, 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 quick. <laughs> Just don't quite catch it in time. Anyway, this end of the building, we've got another set of double doors. We've also got another single door that side. Plenty of access. And this is where you're going to buy or sell your chickens from. Let's close that button. And what we'll do is something I was going to test and I forgot to test it. So we'll do it now. Um, like I say, the trigger on the one that we had a while back was quite narrow, but this has got quite a big box. Um, there, this is where your um, feed will come uh, when they are making a mess. So when it needs cleaning out, this is where it will need cleaning from. Surprisingly, that is where you put the feed in. So I'm surprised it doesn't kind of automatically recycle itself. What I'm going to do, we've got an egg pallet, a, a chicken feed pallet. I'm going to put that down on the, uh, on the pad just here. There you go. It takes it automatically from the chicken feed pallet. Is that all it needed? There you go. Or if you've got wheat or barley loose. Like I say, the, uh, the trigger's plenty big enough. You shouldn't have a problem at all. And there we go. They have got enough feed to last them. So then cleaning out the feed area will just be, you know, with a bucket or whatever you want to use it for. And away they go. Up to 400 hens, chickens will go in here. We've got a gate to the side here. If you want to go in and check your animals. If you've got a small enough mower, you might want to come in here and mow the grass down because it's actually quite difficult to see them. But there you go. That's the uh, laying hen house from Merck to Gernbauer. Very nice mod. I like that. A lot of detail, a lot going on. Like I say, I would have just personally belts would have been really cool. But it's nice having all the machinery in here, you know, that kind of thing. Very, very cool indeed. There you go. I hope you found this useful and informative in some way, shape or form. If you have, give us a like. If you don't subscribe yet, please do. If you want to leave a comment, feel free. And if you want to share this video, then please be my guest. Whatever you should choose to do. Thanks for watching.